1986, uh, Chris Olbrecht um, and a producer named Bob Zamuda um, comes to us with a concept of doing a, a telethon on HBO, four hours, to raise money for um, the homeless, um, medical aid for the homeless, um, to provide shelters with more money and medical care for the people who are America's disgrace, um, living on the streets of America. And they wanted Robin and Whoopi and I to be the three hosts. And we all said, yes. So um, we all, uh, they planned the first show, which was at the Universal Amphitheater. And this was uncharted territory, you know, to get all these comedians together in like a farm aid uh, kind of deal, you know, but with funny people. Um, and there'd be, I don't know how many comedians, and we'd sell t-shirts and other things and shoot mini documentaries and so on and so forth uh, to roll into it human interest pieces produced by John Moffat and, and Pat Lee and we meet about two weeks before and we all start thinking about a funny opening how could we do an opening together now you knew Robin a bit before this. I do uh, knew um, well but not I can't say great you never um, worked together before. Um, no, we did that HBO oh, special, right. um, but that and we done you know fooled around a little bit, but um, and great respect for each other. We were managed by the same, you know, by David and and Buddy, so we knew each other well, but not like what was about to happen. And then Whoopi, you didn't know at all. I didn't know Whoopi very well at all. I just met her when she did her Broadway show once, and that was it. Um, so now we're thrown together for this common cause, and it couldn't have been more delightful and more creative and more impactful in our personal and performing lives than getting to do the comic reliefs together. And the first one was we wrote an opening, and we did this opening, and it got really good reaction. And then as we walked off stage at the amphitheater after doing this opening, Pat Lee said to us, the phones are ringing, and the three of us started to cry. And they're out there. They're listening. They're donating. And we raised a significant amount of money on the first one. And we were then brothers and, and a sister um, for all the rest of them and had some extraordinary moments together. Because what was great about it was the whole comedy world came out all these people wanted to perform. I remember we had to um, convince the producers. We wanted Dave Chappelle on, on the show. It was, a, I think, one of his first television appearances. Um, Shandling was hilarious. We, had, we did tributes to, to um, veteran Jerry Lewis came out one night, uh, Dick Van Dyke show reunion. I the, remember on that the very first comic relief, didn't you have Sid and Carl do the Professor Von Know-It-All Yeah, piece? and so, yeah, so we had, we had moments that if you're comedy nerds, you just want, I can't believe what I'm seeing. And for us to, to be the, um, you know, the chariot drivers of it was an extraordinary experience. And what was also phenomenal was HBO paid every bill. So whatever money came in went out right the show didn't have to pay for anything they paid all the expenses so we would um the organization um that was uh, overseeing all the money um would would pick out shelters across the country that they deemed the most needy and so i remember we there was the, the venice family clinic and then Around the, around the country, I remember going to Washington with Robin and Whoopi, and and we we get in in Congress, and we we have a Ted Kennedy hosted a lunch for us in the office, and then we speak in the Mike Mansfield room, which was awesome, and we then bring a check for two hundred fifty thousand dollars to the House of Ruth a shelter for, for, um, 
for women and we'd buy them a medical van and we drove up in the van and and i'll tell you you know it's it's great to be in front of people and 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 perform and make them laugh but when you're doing something that means something to them and helps them and you and you you're part of it and you, and you 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 just you hand them the keys to this van and they hug you and they they look at you with tears in their eyes and and some of them are victims of spousal abuse um, or that they're ill or they've been living on the streets and what and you make their life easier for Robin and Whoopi and I that bonded us as family that's almost like a, a brand or a tattoo you know on uh, in my heart actually 